So let's open her up. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Steph if you're new and subscribe down below for new content from me. I post on Wednesdays and Saturdays so stay tuned for that. I post all kinds of lifestyle, travel, vlogs, that kind of stuff. But today is a real good one so let's get to this video. Today is the day guys. I finally get a MacBook Pro. I have literally wanted a MacBook of any kind since like high school and of course I got a computer for college for my parents but it just didn't make sense at the time to get a Mac based on just like everything I had to do for school it just didn't seem worth the price at the time but I have saved up so as you can see here I have this lovely bag from Apple Oh, just look at her. Just look at her. She's so pretty. I did end up going with the silver instead of the space gray. So I did get the silver. And I will put everything that I did for it in the description and on the screen. So I did get a MacBook Pro 13 inch, the 16 gigabyte memory, and I did and the 512 gigabyte space. So let's open her up. <gasps> There's a dent in the corner of the box. <laughs> oh, quick story before I continue. I actually had a dent on my other computer. Last year in my dorm room, I dropped it on like those big trunks that people have yeah it has a huge dent in like the middle of it you see right here there yeah she still works fine all right let's open it up It smells new. Oh Alright, this is what it looks like. When you open it up. Oh my gosh. Okay, a lot of people get new MacBooks and a lot of people make these unboxing videos. But I've never had a Mac before, guys. I have an uh, uh, what am I saying? Apple phone. An iPhone. But I've never had a MacBook. So, this is a big moment for me, and by the way, I paid for this entire thing with my own money, so, yeah, she's poor now, just saying. Alright, I guess we'll take her out, gotta do the boring things first. So then we have this, loveliness, okay, we have just the cord, and then the booklet, honestly, sometimes I actually do look to the booklet. Just cause like, especially with this, I've never had a Mac before, so like, there's definitely things I can freaking learn. But also, I mean like, if you think about it, with like new stuff that actually comes with like a book, there's always like hidden features that they never know about until someone else tells them, because they never like, read the book, you know? So sometimes I just do that, but that's just me. Okay, so then we have the charger, the block. This whole thing like smells like new. I love that. Ah! On to the computer. Oh my god. I am literally obsessed. So also when I saw this in the store, it literally looked like the tiniest thing ever. I don't know why. So yeah, oh yeah. Can you see? Yeah, the MacBook is definitely smaller than my current laptop. Let's peel it off. I don't want to get marks all over it. Is it weird that it actually smells like maple syrup? 
Oh. <laughs> Alright, so before I forget and go play with my new toy, um, thank you guys for watching this video. This is a huge thing for me. I've even my parents know it. Like I've wanted a MacBook for years now and it's really expensive. It is. I pay for it 100% with my own money. It's a lot of money and I never spend this much money on literally anything. So I'm gonna cherish it. Hopefully never drop it like I dropped my other one. So instead of an external hard drive, I did get a bigger amount of space on the computer. And then I got this USB-C multi-port pro. Well, I was at the Apple store. And it has like an SD card one, like it has all these different ones. It has a SD micro SD, a 4K HDMI, a USB CPD, and USB A. Just because there's not a lot of ports on the computer, I wanted to get something obviously where I could put my stuff onto it. Like this footage. Yeah, I got that as well. Instead of a external hard drive. Alright, we're gonna open our. So you can't, oh my god, so you can't see my makeshift tripod, but you're sitting on my bed and I'm using my weights. Yes, this is my tripod currently, my weights and my camera thing down here. Yeah, it's great because my tripod broke, so I'm trying to do this as well as I can. Hopefully you see this. So, first is the language. Okay, so we're back. Next is data and privacy. <gasps> oh my god. So I also wanna mention again that I have never had Mac computer before so I have been looking at a couple YouTube videos to see how to like customize it make it more of my own so bear with me I'm gonna try and do some of those things I'll link below the videos and the people that I got so as I was saying I am going to link below all the videos I used to help me all the people I used to help me to customize it and make it my own let's get to doing that the fun part right Okay, so one of the things I wanted to try was airdropping to my computer. My phone, because I thought that would be super cool. <gasps> Steph's MacBook Pro! So, I might change this. I just really want to, like, you know, put something as my background right now. So, uh, I took stuff from Pinterest and the internet, and I went on this app on my phone called Over. This app right here is called Over. And I just did the desktop size, and I just put a bunch of pictures on it. So, I also don't know how to, you know, put this my background or anything. So, we're gonna experiment with that. Let's try right clicking. There's no right clicking. I forgot about that. All right. <laughs> I'm asking see. What? <gasps> Look at it! It's like my own now. Look how pretty she is. so freaking excited to have this computer i literally am so clueless so that's probably why this video is not that good so i did the analog clock we'll see if that pops up at any point so this is what the time screensaver looks like when you put that on it's just super cute really put together I put a background on it and i did the analog clock 
and I logged into my Apple account. I think that's all I did. But yeah, hope you guys like this.